In this video, I will show you how to fix the ChatGPT something went wrong message. And if this video does help you out today, please consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like on the video, and also consider subscribing to the channel. I really do appreciate it. With that being said, let's jump straight into the tutorial. So as you can see, I've actually got a sample of the error message that's coming up. So as you can see, it says something went wrong. If this issue persists, please contact us through our help center at help.openai.com. Now, generally, the reason this happens is when the service will chat GP gets too full and of course the service can't handle the amount of people. So to try and resolve this issue, what you're going to want to do, so I'm on ChatGPT at the moment. The first thing you're going to want to do is try refreshing the page. So what you want to do is come up to the top left hand corner and next to the web address, you'll see this button here where you can click to reload the page. So what you're going to want to do is give that a click. And after this, what you want to do is just give that a try and see if you can use ChatGPT again. Now, if you're still experiencing issues, then it is possible the server is very overloaded and what you'll need to do is give it about five to 10 minutes to try again. The only other way around this is to upgrade to a plus account with ChatGPT. So to do this, if you look in the bottom left hand corner, you've got the option to upgrade to plus down here. And what it's going to do, as you can see, the free plan is available when demand is low. You get a standard response feed and you get regular model updates. Now ChatGPT plus is a paid subscription. It's currently 20 US dollars per month but if you upgrade you actually get availability even when there is a high demand so of course this will bypass see something went wrong error and you'll be able to use chat gpt if the demand is high of course if you want to use the free version you don't want to pay that's absolutely fine but just bear in mind that when the server is at a high capacity that you will need to try refreshing the page and possibly wait in about 10 to 15 minutes before you're able to use chat gpt so with that being said, I hope this quick tutorial helped you out today, and if it did, I'd really appreciate it if you were to drop down below the video, leave a like on the video, and also consider subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a moment to thank you guys for watching this video, and I will see you in the next tutorial.